coming in to you today with a freaking what? Guess what? Guess what? A kiss extra long sculpted gel fantasy nail review, honey. This is a matte nail. Got these nails at Walmart, honey, at a hundred, hundred, hundred down. I went online looking for them, but I could not find them. But do y'all see the list? About time, kiss. About time, okay? So I'm hunt. I'm I'm on the hunt for the kiss masterpiece extra long. But I was uh, able to find these, so I went with what I got, honey, so I could try to bling these out. But Glam wanted to introduce these to the freaking Glam fam today. This is the Kiss Gel Fantasy Sculpted. Sculpted nail, which means it has acrylic on it and gel, okay? Sculpted, okay? And, um, honey, this is the extra long. And when I tell you, boys, that I freaking love these nails, look at that. Got my rings on, look at that. Holding that. See that? Look how I look. You can hold something. This is my left hand. Look at that. Got my rings on. Got my rings on. I'm able to pick up stuff uh, with them. I've had these on since Saturday. I used the glue that came with them. Uh, I don't put lotion and stuff on my nails when I first, first, first get them guys because this is my right hand see that this is my right hand now you guys I don't put lotion and stuff and cuticle oil and stuff on my nails when I first do them because I have a tutorial up on my channel too y'all I did my first nail tutorial about two weeks ago so I wanted you guys to go and check it out yeah, it's I show you how I do my nails, but I don't put a lot of cuticle oil and stuff on these because you got to remember they're press-ons. So if some of you guys are using cuticle oil and lotions and stuff and having problems with your nails popping up, it's re because you're putting it on there too early. So when y'all see me freshly do my stuff and sometimes I still have stuff around the cuticle, it's because I be trying to let the nail set to the nail bed. You gotta let your nails cure, almost like meat or a marinade. You know how you put some on your chicken and let it sit for 45 minutes? Well, my best advice is don't get your nails wet for about two hours after you get your nails done, okay? My recommendation, like, for real, because the water and stuff will get in there, it lifts the glue, the oil lifts the glue so don't do any of that so a lot of sometimes you can do your nails before you go to bed when you know you're not finna be in a lot of water and stuff like that and then honey do your nails put the heat on them use two different glues and then let them set then the next day if you want to then you could get up and buff the little tips off because I don't like to file my nails as soon as I do them because I don't like to disturb my nail beds, okay? So, if you that's why I do my nails like that. I do my nails, press them on, put them on real, real good, and I let them stick. I put them in front of heat, and I let them sit. Use two different types of glue. That works, too. Loctite glue works. So, get you some sassy and chic. Get you some kiss nail glue with the red top. If you follow my videos, y'all, y'all will know every single type of glue to get. Because I make sure that I let my babies know what type of glue to get. So when you see people, do not do like they do in a nail shop. Put that cuticle oil around your nail and stuff because that's going to lift up your nail. Now, if you want to do that the night before, which is still going to have your nail bed oily, but... If you want to nip your cuticles and stuff the night before or a few hours before. But my recommendation is if you're going to put some nails on within the next few hours, don't put cuticle oil on your nail because it's going to have your nail bed oily. And it's going to make the glue separate from your nail. 
and then pop go the weasel. Your nails have fallen off. So, my best advice would be, my best advice would be, do your nails, put the heat on them, and leave them alone for a few hours, okay? Don't go try to wash no dishes. Don't go try to do do no, no do anything. When I sit down and do my nails, I do everything that I've done for have to do for the day, okay? Because you don't need to put your nails in no type of water because that's going to lift the glue. So you don't want to disturb the nail bed. You want the nail to adhere and you want them to last at least two weeks. So if you follow the steps, Make sure you dehydrate, dehydrate your nails. I use alcohol and acetone nail polish remover. You could use regular nail polish remover, but alcohol and acetone, baby, have your nails dehydrated. Because like the night before that I know that I'm getting ready to do my nails, I'll start putting nail polish remover on the nail beds then. And I'll usually uh, scrape up the surface on them just a little bit, okay? Then the next day... Before I, I get up again in the morning, dehydrate them again. So the stuff that I'm, you know, so if I make breakfast or whatever, wash your face, all that. Then when I get ready to go do my nails, I dehydrate that nail bed again. So a lot of times I dehydrate my nail bed three times. You do a real good dehydrating on the nail beds. And then take your time to put the glue. Press them on there really good. I don't do five seconds, honey. I do about 30 seconds. I have to press these nails down real good. And then once they through, I get a little heat or a heater or a dryer or something, something that with heat. And I put the heat, I put the heat on my nails and let them dry. I put the, I put the heat on my nails and I let them dry, guys. So thank you guys so much. This is the new babies to our family. This is my kiss extra long nail review. Would I buy them again? Yes, yes, yes. I will be buying them again. Because y'all already know I've been wearing the sculpted ones. But now that I could get them in a the length that I really like, honey. Amazon, here I come. Walmart.com. Here I come, baby. Because I got to order about three or four more boxes. So I could be covered for a couple of months. So look at that. Kiss extra long. Uh, said these were $7.99 sculpt the nails but I'm looking for the kiss masterpiece extra long so I just wanted to bring this to the channel hey guys your girl trying to get her subscribers up so those of you that follow me anyway could you guys please hit that subscribe button and thank you so much for your views y'all I appreciate you guys taking the time out I thank you for taking the time out to stop into my channel. Please follow me on all social medias. Glam Jones 1 on Instagram. Beats by Glam on Snapchat. And Beats by Glam on TikTok. So I'm Beats by Glam Glam on YouTube. Glam Jones 1 on Instagram, which that'll be changing to Beats by Glam later. But all my social media is Beats by Glam. My TikTok is Beat by Glam. <clears throat> Follow me over there. I have put up makeup tutorials and videos and pictures and stuff almost every day. So if you like TikTok and want to see makeup and keep up with me, follow me on all my websites, guys. I mean, websites. Social media platforms. And I thank you so much to all of my family, my supporters. I love y'all. Couldn't do it without you.